Hello everybody and welcome back to another exciting episode of Cart Life. If you've been watching the reboot of the series then you know last episode I fucked up royally Vinny's story. I wasted two days trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do as far as making bagels, what ingredients I needed, and then when I finally had the ingredients I literally just basically have shoved the dick right up Vinny's ass and said I hate you and screwed up his baking. He lost his bagels. It was just a disaster. I then rebooted the game and pl played through the first day, kind of knowing what I was doing, and then royally fucking up something else. So instead of playing as Vinny again and pissing myself off, I'm playing as Melanie. Vinny's gonna stay and play as a whole nother, a whole nother story another time. So for now, we're gonna play as Melanie. Melanie gets a bunch of money. She, her addiction is spending time with her daughter. She's going through a divorce, and her goal is to raise at least a grand um, by the hearing, the, the custody hearing on Monday. So she keeps her daughter. We're gonna see how it goes. She's a very warm and friendly person, so the strangers should warm up to her very quickly. And I'm excited to see what's gonna actually end up happening as far as her story is concerned. I'm gonna go ahead and begin the game. And see how this ends up going for us. Hopefully the answer is going to go well. Uh, Vinny will be another day. Another day, another dollar. I'm not going to worry about Vinny right now. Uh, Alright. Oh, Becca it looks so cozy. I assume Becca is our sister. She'll love it up here. She'll be so happy. And I'm presuming we're talking about her daughter. You think so? I hope there aren't any spiders up here or anything. Spiders? Are there? I didn't see any. I don't think so, but I haven't been up here since mom and dad left. Oh, so there must be... She must be moving up to the attic. It's fine. She's seen spiders before and lived through it. I don't know about that, man. I have know plenty of people in Australia who have seen spiders, and I have never heard from them again. So, she'll be over tomorrow? Yeah, I'm picking her up, uh, picking her up tomorrow after school. We'll have her all week. Well, you don't have to worry about cooking. I'll cook. It'll be nice to have people to cook for anyways. Last few months, I've been just been uh, eating go gondola bars in front of the TV. I miss being in the kitchen. It'll be nice. Yeah, I think so. It'll be nice. Melanie, you're looking mighty silent. So, what are you going to do about money? I told you about the coffee business, right? I guess not. You're going to start a new business on your own? Now? What's wrong with that? Isn't that the perfect opportunity? I guess... You're crazy. <laughs> it's simple. I'll get a coffee cart and an espresso machine. A coffee hut, I mean. No, wait. A stand. A coffee stand. Uh-huh. And I'll sell coffee, Becca. What's wrong with that? I might be able to offer some advice if you want, but I don't want to preach at you. We are going to go through the tutorial and relearn some stuff. I guess I could use a pointer or two. I've never run a business before. Well, for me, I use the space bar to bring up my menu. All of my equipment and menu items are there, and it's probably the same for you. Give the space bar a try and see if it works. Okay. This is the main menu. From here, you can adjust each aspect of your life. Select an option. Okay, I already know how all this works. Upgrades, all that good stuff. Yup, I got it. I don't need to worry about that. Did it work? Yeah, I think so. Cool, great. Mine space bar too. Anyways, once you get your equipment, you can adjust your menu prices from that screen. We're getting all meta here, talking about space bars. Space bars, if you know what I'm saying. Also, you can use it to check the time as long as you've still got your phone and your watch. Okay. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't Seth give you that watch? Yeah, so? Are you going to sell it? What? What do you mean? I'm just saying, starting a business can be expensive. You might consider going to the pawn shop to sell your watch. Couldn't hurt to have the extra money. I'll think about it. I like this watch. Okay, fine, fine. What else do you want to know? What should I do first? Let's let's go through the list here. What should I do first? I'm feeling a little overwhelmed. That's a good question, Mel. I guess first I'd actually get the physical stand. You'd probably need some uh, permits or something, too. But where could I get the stand, though? Try asking this woman named Alice. She has a hardware store or something in the Collins District. What do I need to buy? You tell me. I mean, what do you sell? Coffee, right? Yeah, of course. So aside from the stand and the espresso machine, you'll need cups, coffee, milk, and sugar and stuff. You can get all that at the superstore. Right. But if I were you, I'd buy the coffee beans at the Georgetown Roastery. It's on Florin. Sounds good. Got it. Where should I set up my stand? Downtown, definitely. Oh, of course. All right. What should I charge people for their drinks? Well, again, that's up to you, depending on how good they are. How about amazingly good? If they're amazingly good, I'd say two, maybe three bucks, four even. People even probably won't pay that much, but when you're first starting out, though, no matter how good your coffee is, you've got to build a reputation. That's true. Where do I sleep? 
Uh, our old bedroom, of course, where my dad kept a lot of the same old blankets, but I didn't think you'd want to feel 12 years old, so I put new ones. What? I don't get my master bedroom? I get mom and dad's room. If they ever feel like moving back in, they can have it. Then you and I can share the kids' room like we used to. Yuck, no thanks. I've already got to clean up after Laura. I don't want to have to clean up after you two. Oh, and there's extra towels in the bathroom, too. Okay, thanks. Are there any other ways to make money? I say there's a street corner that is open between the hours of midnight and 3 a.m. The coffee stand doesn't make. I could lose custody. What else can I do to make sure I've got enough money to next Monday? Well, like I said, you could sell that stupid watch at the pawn shop. Maybe you could sell your some more of your stuff. I don't think I have anything else. I sold the car already, and you know I don't have jewelry or stocks lying around or anything. I'm glad you sold that car. How much did you get for it? 1500 Bummer. I know! Well, it's money in your pocket. I always told you to sell that car. Who needs a car in this town anyway? You can get to everything on foot. And bus passes at 15 bucks. Okay, all right, just all right. Whoop, up. All right, let's uh, let's say that's all I need. Thanks so much for your help. Let's start uh, going to Alice, which is she's on Collins Street, I think she said. We'll be fine. I've got things. Coffee. It's been take on divorce. Even finalized. We're finalizing it Wednesday. You are Wednesday at noon at the courthouse. I've got all day tomorrow to get my a stand, and we're having a, the custody hearing the next day. Better get your shit together, Mel. I know. I know. All right. So, here we are, new day, down the stairs we go, always exciting, enter your password, ha 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 ha, that's an incorrect password, how unfortunate for me, alright, how about, can I just leave, what time is it, 10pm, looks like I'm sleeping, though I wonder if I could talk to her, nope, guess not, alright, let's just leave, let's go to bed, find your bliss, is this the room I'm sleeping in, it is time to sleep, Time to sleep. Take your hair down, lady. And sexy pixelation. Brush teeth. Oh, we gotta brush our teeth, huh? Oh, alright. Cool. Brushing our teeth. And, wow. That is gonna be censored out. That's an unfortunate situation, I think, for us. Oh, censorship. Anyway, close it. Anytime that happens, that'll have to be censored out. It is what it is. I'm not worried about it. I just don't want to get reported. Boobies and all. Boobies and other things. Who's this? I don't know who that is, but I can't talk to her. I must be my sister. What am I supposed to do here? I literally can't do anything. Merry Christmas! Oh, I forgot it was. You look nice. It's one of Mom's dresses. Does it look okay? Yeah, you look nice. What are you holding? Uh, I was going to drink some coffee to stay warm out here, but there isn't any coffee. Would you mind making some? Oh, I can't. Everything's inside and I'm locked out. That's okay. You don't need that old stuff, do you? We can get more coffee at the store. But it's just inside. If they let me inside, I can make some right now. Just let them keep everything. We'll start over. Come on. We'll take the bus. Okay. Weird. I'll save the game. And we'll uh, say hi to my sister. Will she make me breakfast? That'd be dandy. I want breakfast. What time did I wake up at? 6.30 in the morning? Aw, the pictures of the family. It's adorable. And useless. How useless. I don't know the password. Ha. That's not right. Alright. Hey, Melosaur. Melosaurus. That's an interesting nickname. I'm making scrambled eggs. Sounds great. Can't wait to do it like... I can't make it like Mom did, but I think it turned out okay. See? Free food. Alright, let's head out for the day. And uh, we need to go to Collins, I think she said. Collins Street. Let's go. It's a girl named Alice here. Let's do it. Aquavory. Fine fragrance. Alright, I'm already liking her a little bit better. I, I'm slightly understanding her more than I was understanding the other one. So let's uh, say hi. Let's see what we got. Are you Alice? Because I need a coffee shop. Like, right now. Hey there! Yes, hello. I'm not sure if we've met before. No, I don't think. I'm Melanie. Well, I'm pleased to meet you, Melanie. I'm Alice. This is? Well, it's the shop. Let's engage in small talk. Sorry, I already take. Got lots to do this week. Tonight I'm fixing the heater at the Dom Pactor? I mean, Compactor Raxby? Dom Pactor Raxby? Tomorrow I'm installing a dishwasher system at Catacombs. Good thing they both work on trade. I'll be eating free for months! I need uh, a new cart. I had some questions about buying a coffee stand. Oh, sure. Is that something I can... Do you know where I could sh where I should ask? Well, I've got a few things back at the uh, the salvage yard. What did they have? Uh, what did you have in mind, honey? 
Oh, well, you know, like a coffee stand. I'm on, I'm on kind of a budget. Just thinking, apparently. I could probably put something together. Do you have a permit? Oh, not yet. That's okay, just go to the courthouse and talk to Glenda about a vendor's permit. The courthouse is downtown. Oh, okay. I'll be here when you're ready to start. I close the shop at 6, so anytime uh, before then. Alright, so if we can get here before 6, that'd be good. I gotta make sure I pick up my daughter, though, today. I just don't know where she... the school is. We're gonna go downtown, but before we go downtown, let's just see where things are. That's the superstore. This is 5th and Franklin. Board up stores, potholes, graffiti. Alright, I don't think there's any schools over there. Uh, the city's most affluent district. Patrons of the nearby organic grocery salons, golf courses. They're more than willing to pay extra. I don't think it's there either. Uh, a peaceful green island in the sea of traffic is surrounded by major thoroughfares. Broad pathways planted with rhodanias and azaleas. Central Circle. Uh, being situated exactly between downtown and the campus means lots of walking traffic. The city, though, exchanges a premium fee. Where is everything? Downtown. Commerce and culture. The city charges a premium fee for vendor permit here due to the traffic congestion that it caused. Uh, in the corner in this university store has long been frequented by hungry and financial limited students and also the university staff. Is, is my girl in university? That's kind of weird. Nope, this is where she's got to be. Alright, so higher standards public schools are able. Alright, so she's probably here. So we're going to go downtown to buy this permit while we're here though. We'll be there by 11.30 if we take the bus, which is what we're going to end up doing. We wait patiently. Gondola bars, they're wholesome. I'm already sold in gondola bars, man, trust me. I'll buy as many gondola granola bars as you ever afford to give me. Alright, we need to go see some lady. Eddie's books. Uh, I'd rather not. Is this just a way out, or... Courthouse, Town of Municipal Court? How about over here? Nope, that's not where I need to go. Yeah, I'm gonna stay here. Uh, let's, what's in here? Nothing. The DeMarco Vall. I don't think that's what I need. Let's go talk to her. Let's see, maybe he'll tell me where it is. But I don't really know. Maybe I need to go to the courthouse, but let's say hi. Hi, Bigby. How have you been? Hello, nice to see you in your space. Tim Bigby. You can call me Tim, though. Nice to meet you, Tim. Ask a question. Permits. Do you know anything about permits? Talk to Glenda at the courthouse. Okay, so I gotta go to the courthouse. Thanks, Bigby. You're a great help. I'm gonna say goodbye now. Bigby, I appreciate you and your beautiful face. Beautiful might be pushing it a little bit, but it is what it is. So we are gonna go to the courthouse here and see if we can get ourselves a permit. Uh, this is the courthouse. We need to talk to Glenda. Can we talk to you? Let's see, I don't have a number. Please take a number and wait for your turn. Wait, no. Uh, I drew number four. Ugh. Alright, I'm waiting. I'm number four. I don't have time for this. I have a kid I have to go pick up in like an hour. Number four. It's me, it's me. It's four. How can I help you? Hi, I'm Melanie. I don't think we've met before. I see. My name is Glenda Marsh. That's exactly who I need to talk to. I'm the official city clerk. One part of this job involves answering your public information questions. I'm also responsible for issuing all bus pass vendor permits and certifications. Nice to meet you, Glenda. Uh, let's begin the sale. Happy to answer your questions. Uh, apparently I just have questions. Permits. I need some information about permits. Okay, then I'll give you the same talk I give everybody. Okay. The city only gives out small, limited number of permits for each area of town. Once those are gone, they're gone for the whole year. So which area would you like me to check? Uh, downtown. Hmm. What do we got? It looks like you're in luck. Our last downtown permit is still unclaimed. Great. So let me check on the details here. A permit fee for downtown area is $300. That's charged by the city. $300. That's correct. I am paying the permit. That's great. Okay, great. Got a permit for downtown. Half the city, Georgetown, the other council. Thank you for your cooperation. Join the in the city. Hey, I will. Everybody else can I help you with? How about a bus pass? Do you know anything about bus passes? Yes, of course. City bus pass is $15 and it's good for one year. I probably will not spend that much, but let's do a bus pass. Terrific! Of course. Smile for your photograph. E I smiled. And we're all set. Here's your card. And further question, no, I'm good. 
I'm done. Close. Thank you for your help. Goodbye. Thanks for coming in. Next. All right. What time is it? One something. I don't know what time school closes. I wonder if we have time to get to where we need to go. I doubt it. So let's get our kid. As long as we get back there by six, we should be fine. So we're going to go to the school. Yes, the Bank Hill Academy. The bus will be there by 2.30. Focus Apatol. Papatol. I don't even know what that's selling. I don't want any. I'm good, thank you. Here we are. Bank Hill. Sounds like a plan. Stan. Is she inside? What time does the school get out? Look, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Can I go over here? No, I want to stay here. No one tells me when the school's out, so that bothers me. It's 2.50. Help. Uh, I don't want this. Equipment upgrades. Options. Arriving today. I mean, I figure she's here. Can I just interact with this? No. What time is she supposed to be at the house? Seriously. Look, I don't have time for this. I'll wait till 4 o'clock, and if nothing happens by 4, uh, I'll head home. Alarm, 4 o'clock, pick Laura up. Okay, so she's up at 4. Alright, I'm already here. I'm here, Laura. I'm early. I will do my, my yoga flat reflat. I'll do my lapping. Yoga laps? Is that a thing? Doing laps in yoga? I doubt it. Come on, baby. Laura. 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 Are you Laura? Are you a gangster? Hi, Mom. We headed home? Let's go home, sweet pea. Yeah. All right, good. An automatic trip home. Do we get to stay with Aunt Becca for a long time? I hope we can stay there for the whole year. I'm glad you like it, honey. She's okay with us staying there, right? It'll be at least a week before we get our own place. We might just stay at the house for a year or two. We'll see how it goes. I don't know how long we're going to stay at the house. Uh, let's see if we can stay there for a while. We might just stay at the house for a year or two. We'll just have to see how it goes. So, when you say a year or two, do you mean like until I graduate? Maybe. We'll see how it goes. All right. And I get to stay in that attic the whole time? It's my room now? Yep. All right. You're welcome. It smells good in here. It's all the great food Aunt Becca cooks. Want to help me pull out the cook the something? Couch bed? No, sweetie. Your room is in the attic. We set up the bookshelves and made up a bed for you. In the attic? All right. Where there, where there are spiders? I don't think so. We didn't see any. You'll know I found one when I start screaming. Make sure to communicate the size of the spider by the volume of your scream. That's a smart move. I should tell that to my fiance. Alright, well, can I just talk to her or are we good? La la la. Alright, well, where's uh where's my sister? Alright, well. Are you gonna just sit down here and do laps or Cause that's that's fine if that's what you wanna do, it's just a little weird. And I got things I gotta go do, so. Alright, well, I'm out. I'll see you later. All right, we need to go to downtown. No, we need to go to, what's it called? Collins Street. Ah, she's going to be freaking closed. We'll go by taxi. Ah, that sucks. Spend a little bit of money, but we'll get there before she closes at the very least. Ah, so annoying. Don't tell me you're closed yet. I think I'm getting a headache. It's fine. I need to get this done. Well, hey. Begin the sale. Look what, uh... So what else brings you in today? New card. Questions about starting up a coffee stand. Oh, sure, I remember. And you've got a permit? Yep. Okay, so you're looking for a regular coffee stand. Right. I can definitely piece one together for you. A good one, too. Hmm. One whole coffee stand, a water tank, two sinks. I'll even throw in a menu board and interior lights. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, hey. Did you get an espresso machine already? Oh, you know, I didn't get one yet. That's fine. I wish I had one to sell you, but I don't. Uh, I hate sending people there, but the Superstore has them and it's for around 200 bucks, I think. I'll be here when you're ready to start. I close the shop at 6, so anytime before then is fine. Thanks, Al. See you again soon. Shit! I'm not going to be able to finish it up today, but I will be able to go to the market and buy what I need to. And we can wrap it all up. Alright, let's go to the market. Click here to travel. Bus, sounds good. Might as well. It's free. I paid the taxi just to get the information and go buy more stuff. That's annoying. Yes, I, I know. You're getting a headache because you're probably really hungry. You're hungry and you're getting tired. 
Laura, our Laura bar is looking good. All right, so let's buy items. We need an espresso machine. Uh, what's this? Volition robot, robot toy. No, no, no. I don't want the robot toy. I want a freaking espresso machine. Equipment. Uh, espresso machine. I'm gonna buy it. I'm also gonna buy a coffee maker because, fuck, I'm gonna need it. You know, while we're at it, disposable cups. Let's just start buying everything that we freaking need. Inventory, we're gonna need, let's see. Um, we're gonna need milk. Yes. Cream. Yes. I'm not gonna buy chai tea right now, it's unnecessary, but we will buy sugar. I'm not gonna buy anything else. Salt, box of buns. Maybe a box of granola bars, because we might not want to snack while we're, while we're working. Um... I bought sugar already. Is there anything else I want to make? We could buy cocoa mix. That'd be kind of cool. Let's buy some cocoa mix. Um, what else do we want? Inventory. No, we don't need any of that. And everything else seems to be pretty good. I think. I think I'm done. Head units. I don't even know what that does, but okay. I think we're good. I'm a little... I'm a little nervous, but... We'll close, we'll close, and that's gonna have to wrap it up. We'll go home now, we'll eat a dinner if she's providing it for us, hopefully she is. We'll travel, the bus is done for the day. I'd rather not pay 20 bucks, so we'll go on foot. We shall just walk it, there's no need to not. Let's do it. We'll go home, we'll wrap up the day. Yes, I know, you're getting a headache. I understand, you're hungry. Hopefully your sister's cooked for you. But if not, so be it. Old man! Hey, stay off the grass, will ya? I'm trying to maintain a lawn here. I didn't mean to step on your grass. The lawn looks great. I didn't mean to step on your... Honestly, I didn't mean it. Oh, so I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Just pay attention where you go, where you're walking. Well, I tried, old man. What is that? Like, what you do is you just kind of wait outside your house to yell at people who are walking on your potential lawn. It's not very nice. I think you could live a better life than that, sir. We're not going to eat, it seems, but we are going to wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll look at the dream sequence next episode. I'd rather... Actually, no, we'll go through it now. I'm going to have to edit out the nudity, but that's fine. Uh, whatever. And... Nakedness. Brush our teeth, because we are maintaining good hygiene. Nakedness. We spent a lot of money. I'd rather not sit there and look at nakedness the entire time. And let's see what kind of weird dreams we have for this evening. Uh, people, stuff happening. I don't know what, what that fist is. Somebody jerking off or something? I don't know. Is that, I don't understand what's happening. This is a weird dream. Oh, 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 I'm sleeping in. Oh, God. Uh, space bar until the day the cows come home. Save game. We're up at five this morning. Awesome. We'll stop here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I think it's going to be a better start with Melanie. And as always, I'll see you next time.